about 200 club view residents in King William's Town braved the cold to watch Idols SA finalist Lilo Yebert tonight's grand finale at a public viewing location provided for community by the local ward committee, where he was eventually declared the Idols SA season 15 winner. Yebert is the only Eastern Cape contestant to ever reach the top two. Lilo, from Buffalo River in King William's Town in the Eastern Cape. An underdog, the Idols SA season 15 winner, walks away with a recording deal from a leading record label, a R1 meter cash prize, a brand new car and other prizes from brands such as Telcom, Capitec and Trueworths. Lilo had shown unwavering determination throughout the competition. With his soulful voice and understated charm, he has shown tremendous growth. From the shy aspiring musician he was to the bold and confident top contender he has become. It wasn't until recently that he emerged from the shadows and received the recognition he deserves. I didn't see myself getting to the top two. My aim was the top ten, but as I progressed I kept wanting to stay. What I told myself is that with God anything is possible, he said. Lilo said certain songs and genres had him doubting himself during the competition and one of his low points was when negative things were said about him on social media. But the friends he has made in the house, the trip to New York, the Idols competition itself and the support from his family were the things that kept him going. I hadn't had so many people commenting on how I sing, and it was challenging, he said. But just as I sang in my single Sunshine Through the Rain, I will never lose this hunger. My dreams won't be in vain, he said. It has possibly been the most dramatic Idols season yet. But the Adolsa team were determined to end it with a big bang. Tonight saw Adolsa final two go head-to-head -head at Carnival City, where number Idols Sneezy and number Idols Lilo perform to a sold-out crowd to usher in the new winner and cleanse us of the drama of this season was music greats such as our favorite Queen of Bride, Shoma Josie, Isa Fithi Fithi Platinum Artist Something Soeto and Queen of the Dex DJ Zin, just to name a few. The show has been steeped in controversy, including a contestant walking off and allegations of bullying and tribalism, yet more than 3 million viewers are expected to vote for their favorite pop singer in tonight's final of Idols SA. After a grueling few months, Snern Lanla Sneezy and Somi and Lilo Yiba had to face off for a prize including our one meter in cash and a record deal from Gallo. I've worked hard for this moment, Sneezy, 25 told their Sunday Times this week. From the time I entered the competition, I dreamt about winning. Dreamt about celebrating with my gran and those I love. I will be happy whatever the outcome, but I want to show the country who I really am. It has been an emotional rollercoaster from Somi, who faced abuse on social media and was accused of bullying earlier in the season. The singer from Omlazi, KwaZulu Natal, who has been a favorite since the start of the competition, released her debut single, Kungi Musa, last week. The gospel song was inspired by her difficulties during the competition, which nearly prompted her to quit. It hasn't been easy for me being a church girl in this competition, she said. The abuse also got to me. There was a point where I felt like I wanted to go home leave the competition, the one thing I love most in the world, singing, was breaking me and making me cry every day. God saved me. He gave me grace. Dot the last few weeks saw Somi's popularity plunge amid accusations on social media that she bullied and bewitched fellow contestants Vicky and Virginia Quaid. She has denied the claims. The Quaid twins turned down an invitation to be part of the finale. Virginia was eliminated after viewers showed little support for her in their voting, and the same night Vicky decided to follow her out the door. The finale also included performances from the Mzansi Gay Choir, Shoma Josie, Boiti Thulo, DJ Zin, Yanga Sabetwa and something Soeto. Singer Vusi Nova will perform with the finalists and Msomi and Yida will also perform a duet. We haven't even really spoken to family, quote said Yiba. It's a surreal feeling, because I sometimes catch myself thinking this is the last week I will be on this competition. We will both give it our all. Dot Yibba, 24, who hails from King William's Town in the Eastern Cape, emerged as a dark horse in the competition over the past few weeks. 
few had bet on him to go all the way, when he was named in the top 10. He admitted he had been worried, what people would think of him, and his singing at the start of the competition, but then started blocking out the noise. I had to start letting go of constant thoughts, of what people would say about me. I would second guess myself, 